Hi everyone, welcome to Molly's Storytime. Today's story is Ben and Holly's Little Kingdom and it's called Magic School. Princess Holly is showing King and Queen Thistle her magic skills. Abracadabity bobbity boo, she says, waving her wand. Lots of burps can fly out. Holly has to go to Mrs Fig's magic school to learn some proper magic. I went to that school when I was little, says Nanny Blum. Princess Holly wants all her friends to go to magic school, even the elves. We're here to see the magic go wrong, says the wise old elf. Elves do not do magic. Nothing will go wrong at my magic school, says Mrs Fig crossly. Mrs Fig starts a lesson outside. Who would like to show me their favourite spell? I can do a growing spell, says Strawberry. Babbity, bobbity, bow, grow, grow, grow. Mrs Fig starts growing and growing until she's even taller than the trees. Stop it, stop it, cries Mrs Fig. Rosie tries to help. I know, a spell to make things smaller, she cries. Dibbly, dobbly, doll. Small, small, small. Mrs Fig becomes very tiny indeed and very angry. Oh, I'd better grow her again, sighs Nanny Plum. Figgy, figgy, fig, back to big. As you see, children, says the wise old elf, magic always leads to trouble. Can anyone think of a useful spell, asked Mrs Fig. Magic jelly, says Rosie. Okay, says Mrs Fig, but someone sensible must wave the wand. She sprinkles some fairy dust on the wise old elf as he casts the spell. Jelly, jelly, but not a lot. A little bowl of jelly appears. The wise old elf is pleased with the spell. Jelly, 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 and lots of it, he cries excitedly, skipping around. No, stop, calls Mrs Fig. We don't want a jelly flood, everyone shouts. The jelly flood grows so big that it bursts out of the school. King and Queen Thistle are walking outside the little castle when it swallows them up too. Ah, jelly flood, they cry. Now everyone is trapped in the sticky jelly flood. Nanny Plum, scolds King Thistle, is this your doing? It was him, cries Nanny Elf, pointing to the wise old elf. I believe I did do the spell, admits the wise old elf unhappily. And it just goes to show that magic always leads to trouble. Thank you for listening and remember to subscribe to my channel for more great stories.